Yeah, right, guys. Um, so the other day I realised that there was an actual like a bug with Catzilla, I guess it would be, or it's either a bug with Catzilla or a bug with AMD Crossfire. I'm probably going to go for AMD Crossfire, but you never know; these things happen, don't they? Um, that Crossfire won't enable, and you obviously realise that because you wouldn't have clicked the video otherwise. But um, there's a real simple fix. All you need to do is press Alt Enter on Catzilla when it's running, and it will literally enable the second graphics card. I'm currently using the um, R9 290 in Crossfire, obviously. And well, I yeah, I was using MSI Afterburner, and I realised that the game wasn't, well, the, the benchmark wasn't utilising my second card. And well, yesterday I was just having a bit of a tinker, running a couple of benches, and I thought for the sake of it, I might as well you press Alt Enter because I know it would work with a couple of games to initialise your second card. And boom, it was away. I have had a word with a couple of the support guys over at Catzilla before, and I made them aware that the Crossfire didn't work, but they aren't aware that well, sorry, they, they aren't aware more or less that it did happen. And I, I have messaged them yesterday as well, saying that I found a fix. I haven't got a reply from them yet, but more or less they are aware. And I don't know if they're going to try and fix it or if it's AMD side. If it's AMD side, well, there's not much I can do about it because AMD's renowned for having buggy drivers. But yeah, more or less I'm going to run this bench and show you that it initializes both cards. Hopefully this will work because I just ran it a second ago and it was a right knob. Just went through the whole video and it was like seven minutes of just tutorial showing you how to do it and the fucking thing didn't record my bench <laughs> to prove that it was actually recording the second card. Hopefully, hopefully it'll be a short video. Yeah, it does take a couple of seconds to run. I don't know if it's going to do it this time. But hopefully it will just run off the bat because I did just run a bench itself but you never know. I don't know what's going on. It usually like loads a thousand things up and maybe it's just going to drop me right in there. I'm not sure what's going on with the theme as well. I hate it when it does that. It's like, no, I'd rather it look nice when I tab back in and lose a couple of benchmark points than it look like this. Uh, what are you oh, come on, what's it doing? Maybe I should close it quickly. Oh, it's been a right knob end. I'll quickly close it. Yeah, not responding. Excuse my daughter. <laughs> She's just woken up. It's quite late, it's easy. Yeah, it's like half past eleven. Right, um ah, bloody checking system. Yeah, I never had any issues like this with three D mark or anything, but you know, it's a this is a completely different company. You know how it is. Oh come on! Before anyone jumps in and says I should probably be running this off an SSD, I'm actually running off of three SSDs in RAID Zero. Um, not really. No, I don't want to. Not that fussed. On benchmark. Well, I did this a second ago. It's actually going to run this time. Not responding. That's why it, it doesn't always does this. It goes into not responding, then give it a couple of seconds, and bam, it'll be on your screen. Well away. And hopefully, you guys will be able to see that it's working as well. That's what we've got now. Yeah, I am currently recording in a 1080 from my 1440 because the file size will be a lot smaller, but. Yeah. Less of a frame hit on my hard well, hard drives or whatever. Even though I'm using Bandicam. Oh come on. Take a bit of time, innit? <clears throat> I'm also I'm not aware if this is like a Steam glitch or a bug because I have only got it through Steam. I, I wouldn't I wouldn't know. I'm I'm fully aware that it's far more I know it, it support it a lot better on Nvidia cards, but yeah, these things happen, don't they? <coughs> what isn't he? <laughs> right. Hopefully, you guys can see this. If you can't see this, well, it, it, currently, if you can't see this, it doesn't matter because currently, 
it's on 0% GPU usage and I'm going to press Alt Enter once. Yeah, my second card is now initialized, initialized and they're both running at 75%. I'm going to decreasing. 99%. Yeah, there we go. No. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 100%. Here we go. Sorted. More or less, the bench is running as it should be. Perfectly fine. I'll just press escape to close it. Hopefully that, that did work perfectly well. If anyone's interested, I do get about a 19,000 score on my um, on a 1080p bench. Um, no, it's, it's nearly, it's nearly 20,000, but um, I haven't got any overclocks on my rig at all, uh, currently, anyway. Because I'm, I'm getting ready to do the whole liquid cooling setup. I will have videos coming out of that soon. Like, I am planning on doing this this weekend, actually. Um, it won't be a full full setup though, it'll only be the CPU at the moment, but I'll more or less I'll have both the radiators in with a pump, well I'll have all the pumps and rads in and everything and water blocks I'm just going to get my sec my two more water blocks on the 7th so on Saturday I'm going to have my CPU in and the two more on the 7th, well I'll be buying them on the 7th so probably the 9th I'll have the extra extra um, water blocks, what cool and I'll crack out some mad benchmarks if anyone's interested so feel free to give a, a sub and give me some loving and drop a like if you like this video and if it helped uh, if there's any more issues you have with rigs or benchmarks or anything feel free to just drop a comment and I'm happy to help. Bye.